Hi, this is Achuta Bhava. Thanks so much for scheduling your reading with me. I'm really looking forward to sitting down and taking a look at your birth chart together. And in the meantime, I have a few tips for you that will help you to prepare for your reading and ensure that you really get the most out of it. So the first tip is really simple, and that's to come to your reading prepared with general questions. This could be questions about uh, your health or questions about your marriage or your career or questions about finances just general questions about the areas of life that you are most concerned with. Coming to the reading, having meditated on what kind of information you really want to get out of the reading in the most general sense is the best place to start. When we look at your natal chart, we're going to be looking at the general karma that you are born with, meaning what kinds of events and themes are going to tend to happen around what kinds of subjects in your life. So it's important to come to the reading knowing what areas of life you want me to look into, because if I don't have that information, oftentimes you'll miss out on getting the information that is most relevant to you, the kind that you really want to hear. Um, of course, I can go and just read and people don't necessarily have to have questions, but in 10 years of doing this, I can tell you that 90% of the time when people have specific areas uh, or general areas, let's say for starters, that they want me to look at, um, the readings are generally a lot richer and the information pulled from the chart is a lot deeper. The second area that I recommend coming prepared in is with specific questions. So if you come to the reading with very specific questions, this also helps a lot. For example, I want to understand this particular pattern that I deal with in relationships that it just keeps happening, or I want to understand why it always goes this way with money, these particular kinds of scenarios or circumstances. So there's general questions and then there's specific questions. Specific questions can be like, why do I always end up in this kind of a job? Or specific questions could be like, why uh, do you, can you see anything about what the lessons might have been like around a particular person in my life or a family member or something like that? So specific questions also help as well. That's the second area. So general questions, one, specific questions, two. And finally, the third area, which is to have questions specifically about the past, the present, or the future. I want to understand something that happened in my past. I want to understand something that's happening now, or I have questions about what's going to happen in specific areas in my life going forward. And then Timeline specific is helpful. The next six months, the next three months, the next year, the next two years, whatever the case might be. Um, so if you come prepared with those questions, having taken just a little bit of time to meditate on them, I promise you they'll probably get about 10 times more out of the session than if you just come and say, go, I'm not going to say a word. So that's why I made this video for you. Also, it helps because you, um, I have a bit of a wait list. Thank you for your patience. But it helps having a little bit of wait time to also meditate on what you want to get out of the session, set your intention, as they say, or just think about these questions really deeply. Because the more kind of conscious intent that you put into the process of the reading on the front end, the more the reading tends to yield. And again, these are observations that I've made over a really long time. So, uh, you know, that's my best advice. In the meantime, after your reading is over, you'll also receive a follow-up email containing a recording of your reading. You'll get the audio video. You'll get a copy of your birth chart. And then um, you will also get a little link and video explaining how you can schedule a follow-up. And I recommend follow-ups either at six-month or one-year intervals. So you'll have some instructions on how you can do that after the reading as well. So again, I'm really looking forward to it. Thanks so much for scheduling and we'll talk soon. Bye.